And there's another investigation into a deadly shooting spree in Tucson that injured multiple first responders and left at least one person dead. The suspect is now in critical condition after being shot by police. Will Carr joins us with the latest. Good morning, Will. And good morning, Michael. Authorities are calling this a horrific shooting spree. It involves three separate shooting scenes, at least five people injured, and a lot of questions about what led to this violence. Overnight, new details after a deadly shooting spree injuring multiple first responders and leaving at least one person dead. Shots fired at 2420 South Kino. Someone shot into an ambulance. The rampage starting around 3.45 p.m. when a man in an SUV fired into a parked ambulance, shooting the driver in the head and the other medic in the arm and chest. The 20-year-old driver now in critical condition. 10 being shot at. That same SUV then arriving in a nearby house fire, shooting at firefighters, battling the blaze, hitting a fire captain and two neighbors, killing one. It looks like we got another call at Kino and St. Isadora. I believe that's going to be the same as your call. Moments later, police say the suspect rammed into an officer's car, the two then exchanging gunfire, the officer hitting the 35-year-old suspect multiple times. That suspect is now in critical condition. Authorities say they're also looking for several kids linked to the house that was on fire. It's unclear exactly how they were associated with everything that played out. Michael. A lot of questions there, Will. Thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.